Tin man driving down the road. He sees this. He becomes very suspicious. Let's take a closer look, shall we? This is much closer. A little too close. Kind of amazing stuff going on here. Fire. See that? Like a spot fire that can be blamed on lightning. Let's say lightning started this. Okay, then the fire happened, caught this as much as it did, and it probably just went out naturally. Okay, let's just play along with this. So, so much smoky in the air I can smell. I can tell it um, smells quite fresh. Okay. But then when I start to look at this, for instance, there's in this spot right here, there was no human feet track marks. When I start to look at this, just see if you can see any blade cuts here on this part. But look at this for sure. That's either a hatchet or an axe. But the one I like a lot is this one. So let's try to go in there pretty good. A little bit zoom, I should say. Whoops. There we go. Then I'm going to bring you up like that. And now when you get out of my... Get a I'm going to lose you in the glare. So I'm hoping to get that good. To know if that would be a hatchet. So now a hatchet had to come in. To that small of a surrounding. And that tall. Like I'm holding the camera at 7 foot. Okay, that's 7 foot right there. Would have had to do that. And then if you look at it right... You know, it's come into other spots. I'm gonna, whoops, I'm sorry, I had you in the wrong there. So it's come into other spots here, okay? Choo, 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 choo. Looks like it might have been kind of a, coming from this side, no way. Choo, choo, choo. See that? And look at the angle I always talk about. I talk like a 70 degree angle, a 50 degree, right, even this one right here is in the 45 to 50 degree angle. That one, you know, these couple right there. So, and remember I tell you, I think they're playing around with some fire. I think they have a fire capability. Now right here is one of the other looks we like to see, is we like to see curvature. So I'm switching a hand here, and is this one here showing a curvature face, which I think it kind of does. Look at this right here. So this shows, like how did that cutting, whoops, how did that cutting come in here? We get any good? Yeah. You know, come in here, it has a stop point where the, whatever was cutting, stopped. But also got here, and, you know, to me it almost looks like, was it here done like this a little bit? Like, whoops, But I don't know, because this stuff breaks really weird, right? Is there overabundance of healing? Bark, if you ask me. That's what's happening, and it's killing out some of the species of trees or the select ones that get it worse. So yeah, I'm I'm there on that one, you guys. I'm I'm gonna say my thing is I think they probably manipulated the fire. And um Got the fire going however they do. And yeah, and yeah. Oh, and have come back and checked on the tree for some, for whatever reason, they're testing it out. You know. Well, another nice thing to be able to come back and see on this tree would be one of the drill marks. fresh drum work. They knew they got into some hardy stuff like here, flimsier, tougher, very tough. Told them a, told them a message. 
See, they take a little peek at this too. So slice, oh, and an old injury. You see that? They're checking out an old injury. So slice, slice, you know, a couple slices in. Oh, yeah, she's doing good. She's hardy. These trees are tough. Okay, let's go. Okay, shall we go check this one? Yeah, let's go check this one. Sorry, I'm not really making fun. I'm just trying to be my uh, thinking I'm funny. Oh, there's something to blame it on. Hey, somebody had, he had a campfire here. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. But I know somebody lives... Well, I don't know if anybody lives down there, but there's a couple of signs right there, and I'm sorry about hanging on to the camera poorly. I gotta get back to a proper pad thing on them, so. See, there's even the bus service out here. Peace out.